What about the war, Mr. President? That's a great question, by the way. Great question. What about the war? We're going to build a wall. And it's going to be a big wall. And we're going to have tunnel technology so nobody gets under, nobody gets over. That's what we're going to do. It's going to be a big, big wall, 30 feet high. That's what... Sorry, I've got a text coming in. Excuse me. Look at this. Mexican Groupon offering deals on 30-foot ladders. I tell you what, I'm going to build a wall 40 feet high. We're not going to have any of those bad dudes coming across that border. That's for sure. Did the Russians have any involvement in your election victory, Mr. President? There was no involvement. Let me tell you that right now. I don't know why you asked me that question. You know the answer. There was there was no there was no influence and it made no difference whatsoever to the result. The result was the result and it made no difference. Did it, Vladimir? Yes. Mr. President, could you work with Jeremy Corbyn? Could I work with Jeremy Corbyn? You know, the problem is, fundamental problem here is that we are poles apart. Jeremy Corbyn says, negotiate. I say, invade. But I gotta say, there are women, there are women in very powerful positions in the world. Google, Google is female. Google is female. And the reason I know that Google is a female is because she doesn't let you finish a sentence before making the suggestion. That's true. Uh, Mr. President, what's that red button for? Because at all times, I've got to be ready. Ready in case the bad dudes, Putin, Kim Jong-un, or anyone else for that matter, I've got to be ready to press this button. And if I do, 80 ballistic missiles with nuclear warheads will be flying towards those countries and cities. That's what it's for. Isn't that a bit dangerous? No, as long as I don't touch it. As long as I don't touch it, it's fine. Mr. Trump, geography is not your strong point, is it? So, can you tell me what is the capital of Sweden? Oh, I know it! Stockholm! Well, friends, this looks like the end of the world. This is Chris Wallace signing off and saying farewell. Didn't I tell you all that Trump would f*** up?